Um, kind of similar question I asked Eric, sort of what's, what have you seen of Will Greer? What sort of, at least in your mind, early on, what might be content with that or what sort of needs to happen? Yeah, so I mean, West Virginia, obviously, they have an explosive offense. Um, a lot of very explosive players. Will Greer, like Eric said, one of the best quarterbacks in the country. I mean, we're going to have to come on our A game. I watched the Oklahoma game as well, a few other games I've seen on film, you know, just, you know, like we had the whole week off. So just kind of picking up on the teams people thought we might play. And I've watched a couple of their games, and we're excited for the challenge. I mean, we feel like our defense has, uh, you know, done a solid job this season, and this will be another test for us. And, you know, hopefully, we'll, or we will be up for the challenge. So it's exciting. Kyle, what is uh, going against? I know you guys go against the scout team, obviously, in practice. But just the fact that like your system is, you know, a spread system and a system that passes the ball a lot. I don't know if that plays into and helps more when you play a team like West Virginia versus say when you play like a team that runs a lot of power and that stuff. Yeah, it's definitely very helpful. I mean, we do team periods in practice where we go against our offense every week and. Um, our offense does a great job. Our offense is one of the best offenses in the country. So when we play a team that runs a similar type system, a spread system, um, has a lot of playmakers all over the field, it really gives us the upper hand because you know we see something like that every week. Um, specifically going into the Wake Forest game, they run a lot of tempo. And I feel like seeing our offense every week really helped us. So I mean, running off, seeing offense with a similar system is definitely helpful for you know an upcoming game. Jason, uh, how a bunch of ACC awards come out of the last week? Or that's been a couple from Cisco getting a uh, defensive freshman of the year. Like, what do you think he did to put himself there? And then uh, Dino getting beat up and coach the year by Dabo. Like, any thought in the locker room that that maybe wasn't the right call? Uh, yeah, so starting with Cisco, I mean, Andre's done a great job since he came in. He came in with a really, you know, veteran mindset. He got to come in in the spring, get that spring under his belt. And, you know, I saw the potential in him that he'd be a good player. And I feel like this summer, I mean, he really just locked in and focused on doing everything uh, the right way and, you know, being a leader, even as a young guy. So that was very, you know, impressive of him. And I'm just very proud of him, man. And uh, he worked for everything he got this season. And, you know, it's really inspiring to see a young cat come along like that and be able to help us as seniors, you know. That's everything we look for, a young guy being able to help us get to the spot we want to be. So, you know, Andre did a great job this year. And then Coach Babers, uh, you know, great coach. I mean, in my eyes, you know, top coach in the country. And, you know, we're very thankful for what he's done here. But, I mean, like he'd say and we'd say, you know, we're not worried about the awards. Uh, just worried about going to be West Virginia now. Yeah, we saw your article about it. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, uh, no, man, I mean, we were, uh, we've been locked in all season. Uh, you know, we came in, uh, uh, you know, inexperienced. That linebacker had a couple, you know, big time guys ahead of us, Zaire Franklin, Paris Bennett, Jonathan Thomas. Uh, those guys did a great job for us, you know, in prior years. And uh, so we just kind of felt like we had to lock in and do our job. You know, I felt like we, we maybe stepped up our leadership. Coach Ward did a good job of bringing us along as linebackers, you know. Keeping the system simple, but uh, putting us in positions to win games against you know big time opponents and things like that. So I mean, just doing our job every snap and uh, being the leaders that we need to be at the linebacker position.